What's up everyone, it's Mr. You Know Who, and today guys I'm bringing you a quick video letting you guys know that the system software 8.50 for the PlayStation 4 is compatible with Save Wizard. I know a lot of people have been asking me, should I update to 8.50, and I'm going to tell you guys it's safe. I updated to 8.50, nothing on my PlayStation as far as using Save Wizard has stopped working, everything is perfectly fine. But if you guys are using your PlayStation 4 and transferring saves to your PlayStation 5, I'm not too sure about that because I don't own a PlayStation 5. And I also want to point this out for you guys real quick. The day before April 14th, Save Wizard put out a post on April 13th referencing March 15th, which in my opinion, it's saying that, you know, be careful of the PlayStation 4 and the PlayStation 5. From my understanding on the PlayStation 5, there has been a recent update as well on April 14th. So if you come over here, you guys can see right here, they had a system software update. And I know it has to do mostly with external hard drives and stuff like that, but can't really say too much about any saves because with the whole thing of transferring saves from PlayStation 4 to PlayStation 5, I can't say it's going to work on PlayStation 5 because I don't own a PlayStation 5. The best thing you guys can do if you want to know if A, is everything working as far as Save Wizard, Act Save Wizard, and go to the support page, and they should be able to tell you if that's working. Also, if you are transferring a save from your PlayStation 4 to your PlayStation 5 using probably the cloud, again, I'm not too sure if it's working as far as when you transfer it and you download it onto your PlayStation 5. If it's working, like I said, the best you could do in a situation before you do anything is to act save wizard or you could go to their Facebook page, which the link is here and just ask them. I'm not sure because again, I haven't been able to get a PlayStation 5 in my area. It's been a shortage and I'm waiting to get one just like everyone else. But as far as PlayStation 4 on 8.50 using Save Wizard, it's perfectly fine. Like I said to you guys before, if you have any questions about Save Wizard or if it's safe to update, just go to their Facebook page, be polite, ask them, and they will give you an answer. But that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I just wanted to let you guys know real quick that it is safe for 8.50 to use Save Wizard. And as always, I thank you guys for watching my video, supporting my channel, and I will get up with you guys later. Peace.